Hello everyone, it's Friday, and that means we get to talk about new products. In addition to new products, this week is Maker Faire New York, so if you're going to Maker Faire in New York, make sure you watch out for people with red shirts. Uh, we're not going to have a booth, but we will be wandering around doing cool stuff, because that's what we do. So let's talk about new products. These two boards that I have in front of me are the long-awaited electric imp boards. First up, we've got this guy, which is the electric imp shield, and then we have the simpler and smaller electric imp breakout. The electric imp is an SD card form factor microcontroller slash Wi-Fi radio. Let's say you have an Arduino. Pop out that little protective piece. Slide this in here like this. And now essentially what we have is a Wi-Fi shield plus this can act as its own microcontroller. So there's a lot of stuff going on with this. Now we have this little wireless module. We've got um, the breakout pins over here. And you can have this as a pretty much standalone little microcontroller. You can blink LEDs, you can do some other stuff, read some sensors, do all that good stuff. Check out the full video for the Electric Imp for a full talk with the engineer that did these and um, just to give you a full rundown of all the features of the Electric Imp. We're excited. Um, we have these in. We have these in stock. Um, at the time of the video, you might not see the stock yet. We do have them downstairs, but they're going through packaging and everything. So give it a day. You can put in a back order. These are being built as we speak, as we do this video. So the stock level might be low, but it'll pop right up probably over the weekend. So um, yeah, we've got the breakout as well as the shield ready to go. And lastly, we've got this guy. This is a very um, interesting and slightly odd product for us to carry. This is a solar charger and battery all in one. You've probably seen this at, you know, um, outdoor sporting goods shops like REI or something like that. It's basically this little handheld thing that you would plug a USB cable into and then plug your device, your GPS, your phone, or whatever it is that charges over USB into that, and now you can power that device. Um, inside here, there's a 3,500 milliamp hour battery, so actually pretty decent capacity. And you can see up here, we've got multiple settings. If we press this button, we can go from 5 volt 1 amp, 5 volt 2 amps, or 9 volt 1 amp. We can actually power quite a bit with this little guy. And then the built-in solar charger, you can just charge the battery. Or it's got this other jack on here. It's got a secondary USB that you can plug this into, you know, your computer or your USB charger, whatever, and you can charge it that way as well. And it has this little indicator to tell you how full it is. It's a pretty neat little thing. We've been thinking about making something like this um, for quite a while, because all you need is a LiPo battery, a boost converter, a charge circuit. Um, you could probably use like the power cell that we sell for that whole portion, and then a couple of USB jacks, and then, you know, a couple of LEDs, and then slap a solar panel on it. I like the concept of us making our own, because at least you could use all the individual pieces separately and, you know, hack it to do what you want. This is kind of, you know, completely finished. What I'm going to do is um, take this unit apart and show you what's inside to give you a little bit better idea of how you could go about hacking this. And there we go. So that's your back plate. Got a pretty good sized little LiPo battery right there. Um, it looks like it's glued down pretty good and it looks like it was glued down to there as well. Um, here we have our little board. So I'm just going to try and pry this up from the solar panel. Here we go, a little bit of tape. Tape's always good. You've got a very nice solar panel here, um, which actually has tabs there and there that you can solder directly onto. You've got this board, which I'm sure with a little bit of work could probably come off. Um, it looks like we've got a couple tabs right there and there, and then it's soldered into the panel. So I'm sure if I desoldered here and here, and pulled up these little tabs, this whole board would come up. Actually, it looks pretty easy to hack. Um, you could easily pull out the battery, pull out the panel, pull out that, put it in a different enclosure, and use it completely separate. So um, it's a pretty cool little board. I'm actually going on vacation this weekend, and I'm going to bring one of these along just to charge up the GPS, charge up the cell phone, things like that, just have extra power handy. Um, I'm also thinking about using something like this for um, a remote installation of a camera to where you could have a camera sitting somewhere in a weatherproof box and you could have this as like a power source to where you could have it charge and then you know provide power for your thing so 
there's a lot of different uses for this and quite frankly the price is right you know it's cheap enough that you can use this and hack it for all the individual components so we hope someone gets some use out of um, these little handy solar charger battery things so there you have it another friday product post right before maker fair new york um, we have the solar battery charger dealy and then we have the Electric Imp Shield as well as the Electric Imp Breakout. And we have a couple more new products on the website, so go ahead and check out the full rest of the post. And we'll see you again next week with even more new products.